What's up, guys? This is Sim with Vengeance, and I'm back here with another NCAA Football 14 UAB Blazers Dynasty. And today, your 2-0 UAB Blazers are on the road for their first conference game of the season, taking on the South Alabama Jaguars. If you guys are excited for today's video, make sure you guys drop a like. And if you're new to the channel at all, hit that subscribe button down below. We're going to take a look at recruiting now. As uh, last game, yeah, uh, just Illinois was kind of a breeze in the fourth quarter. But, uh... It seems to me that we're getting uh, quite a few leads on some of these guys. It's harder to get guys like Ben Smith, and uh, we're falling behind on him. But we got a lead on Jacob Ingram. We got Wesley Thompson as a bat as the number one quarterback in the country. He has good throwing power and all that, but we'll see how well he turns out to be. Uh, to see a number one quarterback like that go, though, it's kind of amazing. Uh, we got a five-star wide receiver coming our way. We got a tie for Colorado with him. Uh, looks like we're catching up. We got to catch up some, on some of these guys here. Um, but I feel like we're doing pretty good for ourselves. Uh, yeah, it's good. It's a steady progress for us right here. But we're going to make it work. We're going to make it work. But uh, we're going to take a look now at the top 25. That has been taking a big shakeup so far this, this early on in the season. Granted, the number, I think the top two or three teams are still there. But... As you could tell, Texas is still number one, UAB two. Miami's now three. That's interesting because uh, South Carolina, as you see at number eight, they lost to Georgia. And you got Auburn at four, Oklahoma five, Georgia Tech six, Arizona State seven, South Carolina eight, Clemson nine, Missouri 10, Iowa 11, Notre Dame 12, Vanderbilt 13, Georgia 14, Alabama 15. They went from number... I think they started off top five in the season. Now they're 0-2 to start off their season. And their, their schedule gets tougher because they're on the road taking on number 13, Vanderbilt. Uh, 16 is California. 17 is USC. Ohio State, 18. Oregon, 19. Illinois, 20. Navy, 21. Uh, Colorado, 22. Oklahoma State, 23. Troy, 24. And Nebraska, 25. In the receiving votes, LSU went from 13 to out of the polls. Just like that. Minnesota dropped out, San Diego State, Rutgers, uh, TCU, LSU, Houston, and Northern Illinois. I have other receiving votes in there as well. So it's going to be kind of iffy this, this season for uh, teams that are trying to get in the top 25. Uh, take a look at the SEC standings. Obviously, Mississippi State's the only one that's got a win in the conference play. Uh, but we got the best record, obviously, 2-0. Um, obviously, you got two other teams in here with, or three other teams with one and all records, but we'll see how those play out. In the SEC East, Kentucky, Georgia, Vanderbilt, Tennessee, and Missouri all got wins, while South Carolina, Florida, and South Alabama all took L's. Uh, Heisman race. Is Justin Kelly still in the race? I think so. We'll take a look here, and he is. He got five total touchdowns last game, but the turnovers had to go down a little bit this game in order for him to maintain that Heisman uh, stature uh, 313 yards last game 63 yards rushing he's doing pretty good for himself which is good uh, but we just got to do better we're going to get on with this game though against South Alabama should be a good one and I'll see you guys on the field and we are underway here in South Alabama so Daniel Alexander receiving the kickoff uh, we got it out to the 20 alright that's fine Iowa versus Iowa State time, though, in the in the scoreboard there. Iowa's got a big lead already. Just for the record, though, I am a Hawkeyes fan. I live in Iowa. <laughs> that's why I was so – that's why I mentioned the fact that uh, we had Iowa versus Iowa State. I was like, oh, here we go. Oh, first down. Oh, oh. Are we gonna, about to have a repeat performance of last game? <laughs> it looks like it from the start. Get it off. All right, there we go. First down and a little bit more. We got eight yards. Okay. Yeah, that pressure was coming as soon as I started to scramble. I saw him out the underneath. And I did. Oh, right there. There we go. First down again. That's what I'm talking about, baby. All right, let's not have a repeat performance of uh, that play. Oh, that was a good interception. Okay. That was not a pass I should have thrown. Whoops. Third and, third and 13. Perfect. Get 
Oh, uh, he didn't get it. Oh, they, they get what? I'm going to have to debate that. Back to Hannes again. I spell screen pass. Oh, it hit. Okay. I'll, I'll take that. Whatever. Whew. Oh, Alexander. Oh. Oh, nice return. Let's go, man. Beautiful. There we go. William Davis first down. Thank you. Gonna about, about to get this passing TD, though. Over the middle. I smell six. Frank Clement. Called it, baby. Let's go. All day. Go. Do your thing. Make these guys not get a touchdown. Oh, it's almost picked. Oh, man. Look at him. Oh, my God. He's devastated. I must have killed their season with all those turnovers I forced on him last game. Oh, God. He's wide open. Get him, Lynch. Get him, Lynch. Oh, f wow. I took a bad angle on that one. I'll admit that. I took a bad angle. I cannot have this all game long where my offensive linemen just decide not to. to. Oh. Oh, that works. William Davis, first down. Oh, oh, nice grab. Oh, my God. Frank Clement, you got some hands. Oh, Jesus. Nice throw. That's beautiful. Nice grab, too. Oh, Cedric Maxwell. Touchdown, baby. Let's go. Beautiful throw. Come on, defense. Let's go. Make a stop. Oh, my God. This is not happening with this. I don't want to give up these points early on in the game. Oh, we could have got the INT. We could have got the sack, too, but whatever. We'll take All right, that's, that works. 14-10. Second and one. Here we go. Oh, we got it. See, if I would have cut back inside, if I would have taken the, the hole there, I'd probably got more, but I don't know. Over the middle. Nice play. Way to take that and take some more with it, too. Doing more with that ball. Oh, Frank Clement's got, like, the nicest hands ever. Oh, my God. Such a good player. Such a good player. UAB is up by four. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. All right, there we go. Touchdown. Whoo. There we go. That's all we got to do. That's all we got to do, man. Let's get TDs. Nothing's back up again. Third and 18. They're going to run four verts or something. I have no idea. I couldn't tell you. Well, I can't kind of tell you. Nope. Just they lost play. They lost yards on every single down on that. That was just not smart football. Oh Jesus! Such a tight window, but he somehow, some way, Justin Kelly's just the man. Oh man, number four Auburn's about to go down. Frank Clement, another one. Give him another. That's another touchdown, baby. Let's go.
to make another stop. Are they going to stop the clock? Is that going to stop the clock? We got to stop. Uh, oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. We're already in field goal range. Daniel Alexander so good at what he does. Oh. Oh, I thought we could have broke that tackle. Oh, can we get it in? Oh, we got it in. Touchdown on the draw. I hardly run draws ever, but that one worked. That was beautiful. Good job. Positions taken up. You would think they would get, be getting better because they're already they're pretty good in SEC play. Andy Payne. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. You have 19 for 220. Just killing it. Oh, Justin Kelly making it look easy. Daniel Alexander getting the yak. We're just gonna run it. Oh, oh, oh! Tough yardage, but you know what? It works. Ten carries. Six. Well, they're spreading them out. Give it to the big fella, Aaron Hardy. Oh, way to go. Get a touchdown, man. There you go. All right, let's get it. Oh, it's intercepted. Oh! What a grab by John Johnson. Big, bu big boy going up and get it. I like it. How will we respond? Oh, big grab. James Hester Jr. down the field. 27 yards. So what do you think of this receiver after that play? Oh, that's a touchdown. Thank you. Whoo! 49-10. Screen pass. Oh, crap. I missed it. Oh, okay. Marvin Rivero, nice grab. They're both on this drive. That's just amazing. He's just a beast. He looks like that guy from the replacements, the, the crazy cop guy. He could be, he's like that kind of mentality. Big mistake. Another turnover. Oh, get juked, fam. Ooh, you got juked. Oh, my. All right, y'all. Third and 12. Nothing to worry about. We got this. And touchdown. Oh, we can't. Co oh, we got it. Oh, that works. Okay. This defense, it works. Get the crowd hyped up. Oh my goodness me! Pick six. How did you get that one? I have no idea. Whatever. I'll take it. <laughs> Here we go. One for nine on third downs. Let's see if they can try and at least make it themselves respectable here. Uh-uh. Nope. Nice try. Nice try. You can try again. Look at that. Oh, my God. This is ridiculous. Just I wasn't even expecting a first down on that. That was crazy. Oh, my God. Justin Kelly. Give me another. Well, that's kind of rubbing it in, but <laughs> I didn't think I was going to get a touchdown on that play. I thought I was just going to go fall down at the one or whatever. But I guess Justin Kelly had a and, and that's your game. Final score, UAB 70, South Alabama 10. Justin Kelly had seven total touchdowns today and just absolutely destroyed it. Had a good contribution from the run game. Defense stepped up, played well, moved up to 3-0.
So anyway, we're going to get on with our next game here. And uh, thank you guys for show, uh, showing up for today's video. If you guys uh, enjoy, drop a like. If you're new to the channel at all, hit that subscribe button down below. And until next time, my name is Sim with Vengeance. You guys have been amazing as always. I'm out. Peace.